So my Minnesota Vikings lost their first game of the season yesterday against the Detroit Lions, 31 to 29. Congrats to the Lions. Congrats, Lions fans. You guys earned that win. It was a pretty exciting game, right? Both teams had double-digit leads. Both teams lost the double-digit lead. And the Lions were able to close it out. It's those close losses like this that makes you think about those opportunities that weren't taken advantage of. Like when the Vikings had a 10-point lead, the holding penalties that they had, the defense giving up 28 points in four consecutive scores. There was opportunities for the Vikings to close out this game, even in the fourth quarter, even with all the mistakes they made, they had opportunity to close this out and win when Ivan Pace had that fumble recovery. I went crazy during that time, but they went three and out. Detroit got the ball. Detroit did what they had to do to close it out. And even the Vikings had the opportunity to get in field goal range and then that penalty they had, they had to go for Hail Mary. I like what Kevin O'Connell said in which they would have gave Will Riker an opportunity to kick a 60-something yarder. And I personally believe that he would have hit that if he had the opportunity to kick that 68 yarder. Should have tried to go for 72 as well. You never knew what's going to happen. <laughs> but there's a lot of stuff for the Vikings to fix. And even with all the mistakes they made, they still made the game close. Still had the opportunity to win the game as well, even though they didn't. And Detroit from the NFL analysts is the best team in the league. The best team in NFC. So to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with this team, had an opportunity to win it, but obviously did it. Some things to look forward to. Now I know they're five and one right now. And some Vikings fans are feeling that this is the collapse right now. This is it. They're gonna start losing now. Good thing you guys aren't the one to be playing the game on Thursday. Vikings the opportunity to right the ship. Opportunity on Thursday to Get the stench of this loss out and take it out on the Rams. Go to six and one. Still have a great spot in the NFC, the NFC North. Opportunity to still win a division. Opportunity to still make the playoffs and stuff. But gotta take care of business this week. Gotta update some stuff. Hopefully, TJ Hawkinson, Dalton Reisner is back this week. And it now is on to the Rams. On with opportunity to go to six and one. Take care of business this week. Make the corrections you need to make. But I'm still proud of this team for going toe-to-toe -to -toe with the supposed best team in the NFC. See you guys week 18. As always, skull, skull, skull.